This is the letter sheen, and it makes the sound we think of as sh. It's also the very first letter of the word sheon, which means something, just like the English word something, some undefined, unknown thing. Now in Arabic, we can make this definite by adding the definite article al. So this is al sheon, the unknown thing. And this is a word that appears throughout early mathematics, such as this 10th century derivation of proofs. The problem for the medieval Spanish scholars who were tasked with translating this material is that the letter sheen and the word sheon can't be rendered into Spanish because Spanish doesn't have that sh, that sh sound. So by convention, they created a rule in which they borrowed the ck sound, the k sound, from the classical Greek in the form of the letter chi. Later, when this material was translated into a common European language, which is to say Latin, they simply replaced the Greek chi with the Latin X. And once that happened, once this material was in Latin, it formed the basis for mathematics textbooks for almost 600 years.